We left Johnson City, Tennessee, the morning of March 7th for our trip in Florida. We only would stop where and when we wanted to, according to our desire, mood, or current state of mind. We first went through Georgia and took a break around the lake, which we found completely randomly. The feeling of the sun. Only a fisherman and his dog. A hidden place almost invokes a psychedelic echo. We entered Florida early in the morning. The sunshine state indeed. We stopped at Panama Beach for our first encounter with the ocean. Heavy clouds playing with the sun. The constant flow of the dense ocean. Birds flying. The infinity of the space in front of us. We got back on the road among thousands of pine trees. We entered the forest and at the same time the sun began its falling run. Mysterious. The infinity of color, stones and shades. The return of immemorial times. The Everglades. This time, the jungle was everywhere, taking all the space, invading each free part of the land. Stuffiness. Stifling. Oppressive. Majestic. Nature in its purest state. The wild. We decided to reach the southern point of the US. Key West. A drive where the car is suspended in the air between sky and ocean before reattaching to the land of another island. Our last sunrise in Florida was in Cocoa Beach, before we definitely left the Sunshine State to come back in Tennessee. This sunrise was a reflection of all the different places we went through, of the moment we spent looking at the sun, playing with the water and with the horizon. This sunrise was an echo of the power for unity, encompassing the infinite variation of our surroundings. <laughs>